Land of the free, home of the brave. The flag means a lot to me, but it means, uh, it means hope, prosperity. Born and raised in Des Moines, Captain William Doan has served in the Iowa National Guard for over 12 years. Fight against tyranny and most importantly defend freedom. While he's protecting our nation's freedom as commander of the Echo Company 334th Brigade Support Battalion, his parents' and grandparents' fight for freedom is traced back to the Vietnam War as they faced the threat of communism while living in South Vietnam. On my mom's side, uh, my grandfather, he uh, served in the South Vietnamese Army uh, working alongside U.S. forces during the Vietnam War. He was a transportation officer. Captain Doan's aunt was the first to establish freedom in America thanks to the fall of Saigon signifying the end of the war. The rest of the family soon followed. Towards the end of the war, uh, it was going to be taken over by communism. And we all wanted to, you know, seek a better life. And during that time, nearing the end of the war, uh, the U.S., uh, with open hands, you know, helped uh, individuals to go to the U.S. and live a better life. In Doan's family tree, Independence Day hasn't always been a given. It means more than just a day off with uh, hot dogs, pizza, and, and drinks. Uh, it's, a, it's a day to reflect. It, it provides opportunity to uh, dedicate in different ways on however you want to dedicate the, the day to. That's why for the Des Moines Lincoln grad, it was America's long history of defending other nations against tyranny that made Doan know at an early age where his life was heading. As I, you know, uh, grew up and learned more about our country, most importantly our constitution, and eventually seeing uh, the great things that we have in this country that's provided for us, that's something that I want to fight for. Now he's defending the same flag that was carried into Vietnam to help free his ancestors by helicopter. Pretty much live on the legacy of service. And also, uh, I chose to serve because I want to give back because it's the least I can do. Around 115,000 Iowans served during the Vietnam War. A memorial near the state capitol pays tribute to the nearly 900 that were killed in battle. While that was decades before Captain Doan's birth, it's something he sees clearly to this day through his camel-covered uniform. The words cannot describe how much, uh, uh, how much gratitude and, and how grateful uh, I am for, for their sacrifices, for them fighting for freedom and also working alongside with my grandfather. A glance at any memorial dedicated to a war America has fought in proves the cost of independence can be deadly. But for Captain Doan's family, that cost has also been life-changing. To reflect on that special day in terms of what occurred and also, most importantly, recognize the, the sacrifices that were made uh, for this great nation. In Des Moines, Justin Cernsey, WHO 13 News.